So in part one, we successfully killed a bunch of sims in five different ways. Now I want to finish my list off. What a stupid looking bunch of people. We got a random alien chick though. I wonder if she can swim. Alright, let's build him a pool worth drowning in. That was hard. Alright, everyone, hop in. Great, good job, guys. Now, don't mind me. I'm just going to wall you fellas in. Don't worry, it's just for safety reasons. It's even called For Your Protection Chain Link Fence. I told you, safety. <laughs> Can the alien lady even drown? Like, do they need oxygen? Now, they all have this moodlet thing saying secretly relieved, which tells me it's from peeing in the pool. So basically, they're all swimming around in each other's piss right now. I like that they get the uncomfortably warm trait <laughs> from being in the warm part of the pool. We all know what that means. You're swimming in piss, mate. Oh, <laughs> it's begun. We've had our first two sims drown. Only six more to go. This is going to be you in about two hours. There goes the third one. Bye-bye. And number four is down. They're dropping like flies now. Or should I say drowning like flies? Ha! Get it? They're drowning. Oh, look, there goes the alien chick. Oh, there's Mr. Muscles. And there we go. There's the last one. Oh, look at that. That's beautiful. Just look at that. Oh. Now, you may say this is fucked up, but by watching this video, you're condoning my behavior. So this is on you as well. So I've set the room up with a bunch of speakers in the hopes that one will eventually break and this idiot right here can attempt to fix it and in the process, killing himself due to electrocution. All right, so I've turned every single speaker system on. Now we just need to wait for one to break. Ready, look at this shit. Where is it? There we go. Boom. Look at that. <laughs> is that not just the stupidest bloody thing you've ever seen? Now, watch this. <laughs> and now he's dancing. Oh, look at him go. Look at those moves. <laughs> this fucking game. Oh my god, so it finally happened. Alright, now let's try and repair it. Hopefully you're bloody stupid enough to kill yourself in the process. Oh, bullshit. You repaired it? God. About bloody time. He got through about three speakers before he finally got electrocuted. Alright, let's starve this guy to death. I've locked him in a little prison where he can see food, but he can't touch it. We have to make it miserable for him. Well, this shouldn't take long at all. Look at the food. Look at it. Look at it. You feeling hungry yet? Huh, I was right. It really didn't take long at all. So, I was thinking, what would be the best way to embarrass somebody? And I decided to make a really bloody stupid looking person and force him to walk around in public half naked. I mean, look at this sexy beast. Well, let's go to the park. Look at him strutting his stuff. Yes, good idea. Eat more food so you get even fatter. Hopefully it makes you die of embarrassment faster. God, all the lady had to do was look at him and all of a sudden she's burst into tears. Great, now he doesn't just look like a troll, he's walking like one as well. All it took for him to get embarrassed was to start talking to a pretty young lady. Finally, he's completely embarrassed. Oh man, that's how little she cared about you mate. She's bloody doing push-ups next to your corpse. 
I think she's proud of killing you. So I'm not exactly the funniest guy around. So in order to make this guy die from laughter, I've turned to Google. Ah, here we go. Let's see what we've got here. Girl, do you believe in puppy love? Boy, I tried it once, but their assholes are too small. <laughs> Awkward. <laughs> okay, let's try again. A woman walks up to a guy in a blue bathing suit and says, Did you know your eyes match your swim trunks? He says, Why? Are my eyes bulging? Ha <laughs> ha, get it? Penis. I knew that one would get him. The internet's hilarious. So this is Dirty Hippie, and he's always dreamed of being eaten by a giant plant, so I'm going to help him out. I've planted a lovely cow plant, now all we have to do is wait for it to be big enough to be able to eat a human. Shouldn't take long. Oh, there we go. That's plenty big enough. Ooh, cake. You should definitely try and eat that. That poor cow plant probably got so many diseases from having to eat that dirty bastard. But hey, that's not my problem. All I care about is that's one more death off the list.